Hello fellow engineers and welcome to All Quiet Roads. Today we are going to continue our journey. We've done London, New York, Paris, Rio and now we're in Seattle. So this is the lovely Seattle and if you've never seen this game before basically it's like if mini metros met mini motorways but it's sort of different to both of them. So essentially you have different locations so we have a square here if we hover over that it comes up telling us what it is. It's an office tower. Very nice. The triangle is a business. And then that is an airport, I'm pretty sure. Yep, airport. And all of these places generate people that want to go to different places. And you can see the triangle. It has one person waiting, a square. So we've got to draw a little road. So we grab our little hard hat cursor. We draw a road up to there. Press play. And then the little square leaves the triangle and he heads up there. Meanwhile, if we connect the bottom to up, the airport goers left the square. And they will travel through the triangle down to the airport. Now, I think I'm going to put a little bypass in so that people don't go through the triangle all the time. Uh, the only thing we have to take note of, there will be like people giving way and stuff at those junctions. But I think for now, that's fine. There's a circle up here. So I'm going to do a little coastal path along there. Uh, bottom left, these are our tiles. So we've got 16 road tiles. We've got six high speed road tiles. We've got four flyovers, which are basically bridges. And then beneath that, we actually have 12 bridge pieces. So I think what I'm going to do, I got to get this circle involved. I'm going to head along there. And then each time we go across the water, we use one bridge piece. So it's not like mini motorways and that you get one bridge. This has used most of our bridge pieces. Uh, and we just destroyed a tree. Sorry. Uh, but then we're going to come down to there and connect in that way and probably do that into there. That's pretty good. We've got six bridge pieces i'm thinking about can i come across there in a bridge and there we go top left that's how many points we get and each time we fill up the bar we get some more tiles so you can see bottom left we've now got loads of road pieces oh man i don't know how we're going to connect the triangle up i think we're just going to have to go up now there is another house that spawned up there so that's probably not the end of the world um but let's go let's go straight down like that and do <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't help myself. I really, I really couldn't help myself. I feel like that would be efficient. I thought it would be efficient. Anyway, instead, we're going to go straight down, destroy the tree. Sorry, tree mate. Down into there. And then all these people leave the triangle, head up that way. Lovely jubbly. We've got another circle road up there. So let's take that down they're gonna have to go through the square for now because we've got like no road tiles but something we have just been given five roundabouts yes so if we zoom in there did you see that went red like it's going orange that's sort of like your google maps like if there's traffic you, you get some colors and they're being slow because there are junctions everywhere so if we bung some roundabouts in that will speed everything up very very nicely so right we get to pick a reward because we filled up the bar we got 100 journeys completed so we can either go with 15 road pieces and five bridges or 10 road pieces and five fast ones i think we'll do the 15 and the five i feel like bridges are going to be pretty useful on this um top right we've got a triangle i'm going to try and bring you over this way sorry tree i keep destroying trees uh, to the roundabout and then down here we've got a triangle i guess we'll bring you straight across cross like that not ideal however thankfully over here this button this allows us to trade different pieces for other pieces and if you watched last week's video you'll know we had this one which looks sort of like a frog poking out or maybe a hovercraft or something that's actually a ferry and i feel like on this level that might actually be really useful we've got a lot of water about the place so we might be using that later on right house down here let's just connect you up with a junction like that that's on the inside of a bend that's very poor engineering i think my last bosses would be screaming at me for doing that but it is what it is yeah uh, we've then got oh we've got a house on an island why would you build on an island yes hopefully i'll be distracted by picking a reward i like picking rewards and i feel like in this situation probably the bottom one is more useful because i think i can trade the fast roads for stuff if i don't want to use fast roads generally i do like using them uh, but it is always a bit nerve-wracking but i did want to try and do a different technique this time of sort of doing a web sort of trying to connect everything now at the moment i'm definitely struggling with the number of pieces and also can i even oh, i can trade i can trade one-way roads for roundabouts and i can trade normal road pieces for roundabouts okay that's quite that's quite good to know although rather than the roundabout the clover leaf is a lot better because basically the clover leaf has zero give weighing so we probably will want to do that at some point but anyway let's let's just get everything connected we need to bridge you across so i think we're going to come off that roundabout and just connect you straight in and then i think we're pretty good what have we got spawning down here we've got another housing estate and because you've spawned there, mate, everyone, all the through traffic is going to come through your house. How do you feel about that? Well, if you're like any housing developer in the UK, you probably don't care. <laughs> 
Anyway, top left, we've nearly filled the bar. We're nearly up to 300, which means we get to pick another reward. Now, although I did say bridge is going to be useful, the bottom is so many more road pieces. I'm going to go with that, definitely. And then we're going to get something spawn all the way on a separate island again. God damn, what is that? It's a school! You can see the teacher there wearing a, her cap thing. She's very, very scary looking, actually. Um, but if we come down here, we should just be able to do a very small little bridge across there into that roundabout. Nice. Now, then there's a housing estate behind it, so we'll bring that down. Uh, down here, we've, we've got a bit of traffic by the airport. I think that's because we've got, like, junction carnage. I might keep a road going in like that, but then if I do a bridge across there and connect up to that, wang around about there, then hopefully we shouldn't get any traffic going through the airport. Although look, we get to pick a new reward. And I'm definitely going to go with the top one with the clover leaves. That is way better. So where we've got these roundabouts and you can see people giving way and stuff, you can see it's it's, it's not very nice. They're, they're, I mean, they're good. They're better than a junction, but they are causing a bit of carnage. We're going to grab the clover leaf from down here. We're going to place that on top of the roundabout. That gives us the round about back and then you'll see basically anyone can go in any direction they want and there's no give weighing which is very nice now, oh i've just noticed there's a blooming stadium look the m is a stadium shape but the stadium spawned on my road when did that happen i missed that so let's just hit pause what we'll want to do we want to bypass this and sort of do that thing but i remember there was a little an annoying thing that happens in this game and that if we press play because they're so close they've connected to the stadium now i don't want that to happen so i'm going to delete both of those again and then i'm going to press this button here i can then click that which means basically no automatic road connections are made and i can also say no through traffic so no one can drive through the stadium and then if we go back and we build our roads again then when we press play you can see there's no connections made and all the traffic that was going through the stadium now has to go around it now, the other thing i want to do i want to put a roundabout there but i can't it's too close what if i were to move it back there is that now too close to the bridge no, we can have a roundabout on the bridge. Okay, that's fantastic. Uh, next up, let's hit pause because down the bottom, we've got a triangle born from nowhere. I'm going to take you up, give you a nice little coast road, and we'll go into that roundabout. That's going to be absolutely mental. I'm going to make that a clover leaf, I think. Yeah, I'm also I'm going to be a little bit cheeky. I'm going to grab a one-way road, and I'm going to come out of this and go into the airport so basically airport traffic coming along here hopefully they won't go through the clover leaf and round they should just turn off yep it's gone along there sorted and then finally top left we have the return of the hospital now i love the hospital because the little icons they look like little tie fighters so if we come from down here and then connect up to the hospital you can probably then put our bypass of the school in and yeah look we've got tie fighters we've got tie fighters <laughs> uh, right but now we get to pick a reward Ooh, five cloverleaf junctions i think we're definitely gonna go with that but yeah check out the tie fighters going in that's so cool and even better when they're combined with the little airport traffic they're the x-wings so we got full-on star wars Anyway, let's hit pause because this bridge is absolutely chocker. And not only that, we have a blim another housing estate going mental. So first off, I'm going to connect that to that housing estate. And then I, ne I need to give myself options here. We need a lot more routes. Oh, we also got a housing estate down here. What is going on with the housing estates? All right, so basically all the school traffic, all the X-Wings and all the TIE Fighters, they're all coming along this bridge. So I'm guessing it would probably be worth trying to get the X-Wings to come down this way instead. So I I think they take the shortest route, which is honestly a little bit annoying. I mean, an alternative could be to come off this roundabout, do a bridge over to this island, trade a few road pieces for bridges, and then bridge across this island into that clover leaf. We've got an X wing coming down here. They should come off and come down there, I hope. Please, please. Yes. Okay, that's good. So we've reduced the number of traffic coming along that road. Uh, meanwhile, we've got to zoom out because down the bottom, some housing developer is just going mental. And then, oh goodness, this is gridlocked. So that definitely needs to be a clover leaf. That needs to be a clover leaf on that side. And then before we go any further, because things things are just a little bit mental, I'm going to use some of these, right? Because look, we've got 78 highways we can put in. And I think every highway we put in will get more normal road back so i reckon let's try and speed up probably the route to the hospital i feel like that's quite popular route and then we're going to keep going basically all the way down here so through that roundabout 
around the stadium down these two clover leaves we'll make this new road i just built a fast one as well as well as the tie fighter bridge get interrupted by a reward so let's go with the bottom one let's get some bridges then you can see we have cleared up the bridge there are no more tie fighters on the bridge well there are two there but ignore those so yeah that is good what is going in there another housing estate what are you doing so i think we're gonna have to bypass that housing estate and then i think i'll just connect in from different ways so we'll have a connection from that side we'll have a connection from this side and then we've got carnage there so that's going to be a clover leaf this side will be a roundabout and i'm actually gonna i'm gonna try and replace all my junctions with clover leaves so that definitely needs one there's oh man there's a lot of stuff going in up the top there's a lot of stuff going on up here so connect that triangle in connect this housing estate in and i think what i'm gonna do i'm gonna try and make my my like interchange is a ring road so if we go like around here through that roundabout over this bridge up to that roundabout and then all the way up to the clover leaf oh and check out this reward so we've got 25 road pieces two ferries and five overpasses or 10 road pieces and two bulldozers now these bulldozers they allow you to delete a destination which is pretty game changing in my opinion i think i'm actually gonna i'm gonna do that And then we're going to look at making some of these roundabouts faster. So if you look at this roundabout, as this guy comes onto here, he goes really slow and then he's fast over the highway bits. I found this thing out where if I were to just make every arm fast, then when they hit the roundabout, the roundabout circuitry is fast. Right now, over here, I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to do a, another option for basically all of these people to get to the hospital. So if we come out the back of the hospital, we do cheeky bridge over there, then basically just connect sort of over to there then we can connect that up to there and now this housing estate and business park they can they can decide what way they want to go uh, hopefully only the hospital goers will go up oh no that's not what i wanted we've got different sorts of traffic coming through the hospital so let's just hit pause we're gonna have to do a bypass around the hospital and hopefully these guys will turn off yep school's turned off Tie fighter, you're allowed to go straight in. Stadium, you've got to turn off. Please turn off. Yes. Okay, so that's fine. That is fine for now. Oh, wow. What's just happened? There's a triangle over there. What are you doing over there, mate? Okay, I feel like we're going to have to use a ferry. We have got one ferry. And I think, annoyingly, we're definitely going to have to use it. Connect a road up. And then we're going to have to put a route in. Probably to that point. Because from here, we can say, go into square if you want to. Uh, or connect to this cloverleaf. So when we hit play, you can see all these people they'll leave they'll leave there they'll board a boat and then the boat should follow the dotted line and it should connect over there so i think that will be okay i think maybe potentially all right next up down the bottom we've got oh look we've got another airport i feel like perhaps this airport we can try and get all these housing estates connected without going onto our motorway down there. So let's do like a straight through road basically. And then we'll make all these guys connect in. All right, and then hopefully this airport will take some of the traffic from these. I don't want to see any airport traffic going that direction. Like, why are you going that direction? Damn you, X-Wing. Uh, in fact, then I might actually delete that arm so that they have to come out. And then rather than everyone going through this triangle, I might do like an arm probably up there and then if i say no through traffic through that triangle then that should be sorted right, and then we're sort of under control but this road is absolute carnage so let's press pause and i think we basically just need to improve all of our junctions so i think we're gonna have to trade some stuff now we could use roundabouts but it might be worth just going straight to the clover leaves so if i trade roads for fast highways so i can do a load of that i can then trade those highways for clover leaves so now i've got eight clover leaves so i reckon if i just literally just wang this on all of them it looks like that road needs to be improved to a highway as well so it will do a little bit more trading and then we can just improve that road so it's a lot faster and that should speed up everything yeah look at that that's perfect now love to see it all right next up very 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 annoyingly we've got a housing estate there i do actually have 20 rotars i could build the biggest bridge i've ever seen in this game and literally do that we've <laughs> 
we've built a mega bridge. Right, nice. Things are looking fairly reasonable, actually. I'm sort of impressed myself a little bit. I'm just waiting on more tiles, really. I definitely... Oh, actually, I've got... Where did I get them? I got loads. I got loads. So let's let's speed up all of this. We're going to make all of this highway probably over to there. And then I want to do the same up the top. So I don't think I need a highway into the hospital at the moment. I might change my mind because this might, like, back up. But I think I do want a highway being like the bypass road and then I can just highway all of this as well and I can speed this roundabout up by doing all the arms as highway and then that's pretty good cool so we'll just keep an eye on the tie fighters coming in oh they are actually they're slowing down quite a bit yeah so let's make that fast again so now we're now we're in like the the top score hunting stage if you look in the top left we've got two scores going on we've got the main score which is like in big numbers then beneath it, the AQR score. Now, basically, the top score always goes up, but the bottom one can pause. Can you see that's red? That's not going up. That's because somewhere on our map, we have roads that are busy. They're, they're colored in. They're not quiet roads. And this game is called All Quiet Roads, remember? Now, until that's fixed, your score won't actually add up to your AQR score. And the AQR score is the one that ends up on the leaderboards. So what I might do with these, I might just speed up this road and that road. Make this roundabout fast and then the same with that roundabout and that should speed things up although although look there is carnage down here i think we probably need a fast road going into that square but i've run out of fast road so we'll do a load of trading we'll make that road fast make that fast that fast the traffic is thinning i think we're, we're back on track although what i don't like everyone's going through that housing estate so i'm gonna i'm gonna say no through traffic through there stop being naughty everyone stay on the fast roads you knobs and then, oh goodness, oh goodness, there's a lot of traffic down here. Look, it's backing up all the way up here. Oh no, that is not good. Um, I tell you what though, I could take all the X-Wings off of this road by pretty much just deleting that. So then X-Wings out of this housing estate will come along there. I'm, I should probably just speed that up. So you come along there and head that Oh, why are you going that way? Why are you going that way, X-Wings? Oh, I tell you what, I tell you what. Could I do that? Is that a shorter road than that one? Oh yes, it is. Those two X-Wings went this way yes <laughs> okay that is good but what isn't good this is building up i think because of that junction so we'll clover leaf you no you won't you're too close you're too close we'll delete you a little bit and then build it like that that's a lot better and then what i'm also thinking maybe a bypass to like this hospital and the school and i can actually use an overpass so if i come over there go straight over like that i can bung an overpass in and that just makes it like a bridge over the top then i can take this motorway and go over to about there ish and then gonna come from this one bypass that and go into that roundabout and then clover leaf that up and then if i connect a little junction from there into the school then that should mean a lot of the traffic that's sort of going around particularly coming down here should go up instead ah ah why is this carnage this oh my goodness there's so much traffic down here okay we've got we got quite a lot of squares. I think we only have one square on the map. I'm wondering, would it be worth trying to do like a square bypass? All right, there we go. I think I can do that. If I just go from that square down to that clover leaf, that should be good. Now, I'm going to pick my upgrade from up here as well. I'm going to go with the top one and get a few more bridges. And then we're a little bit screwed. We are, we're a bit clogged. But we have hit 10,000. Awesome. So let's hit pause. We can fix this because annoyingly we connected to that building. So if we if we say no connections put that back in there you go right so now hopefully from here we should see some squares going along this road right so annoyingly that's that's proper cocked up for some reason and down here it's backed up so much we're about to lose the game if that bar gets to the top which is going up pretty quickly it's game over now this is where trading comes to its own because you can trade for things like the tow truck so we can trade three road pieces for a little tow truck then we can use that tow truck to tow 194 vehicles that are red so if we click that boosh they're all dead I mean, i'm sure they're not dead i'm sure i'm sure they're fine yeah but then i'm gonna use a bit of one-way roadage because i basically i want to force these people up here to go that way so if i were to do one way probably along there and then say no tr through traffic there no through traffic there then i think when the traffic comes out of here they have no choice but to take my new route yep that's okay oh no we got game over oh you stupid game 
No, I didn't pay attention. Oh, we we got three stars, though. I feel like the game should, like, it should, like, censor you over, like, your bad alarms just to make it a bit clearer. Anyway, if we return home, I, I came 388th in the world. Wow. But I was beaten by a damp wuzzy. I don't even know what a damp wuzzy is, but I don't like it. Anyway, guys, that's how we got on so far. We got St. Louis to go next and then Sydney and Tokyo. Uh, if you're still enjoying this series, boost your like button. Let me know in the comments. Otherwise, I'll catch you guys next time. Peace, love, and traffic jams. Bye.